think I'm in love with this already. Hello and welcome back to another episode of 7 Days to Die Alpha 19. I'm not only 25 and this is Dash or Smash. It's a series where we run around with a hammer and hit zombies as they run all the time. It's a bit of a different hammer I have in my hand this time though because I need to finish building that horde base. I'm going to try and get it done for the horde tonight. I don't know if it's achievable or not. I mean I've got the traps I need on me. So yeah, you know, we can just give it a good old go, can't we? I guess just turn that into that. 139 rebar. Hope that's enough. We've got more concrete slowly, slowly, slowly coming out of there. And hope that's enough. I've uh, got a little bit more cement coming out of there. So, you know, things are moving in the right direction, I guess. Uh, we're a little bit hungry and I think we're out of food, actually. So, uh, we have been stockpiling eggs quite handily here. We can make nine bacon and eggs. It'll last us a day or two. And we'll eat that one now. There we go. Lovely. Uh, let's go and uh, see if we can assess what we need to do over here, then. Oh, yeah, so here's a farmer. Now, somebody's uh, mentioned to me that these guys do double damage when they hit you. Why would that be? And can anyone confirm if that's true? Okay, so I'm doing that like that. Uh, so this needs to be kind of double rebar, really, on the uh, other side. So let's just leave ourselves away up for now. Just something like that for now, so it's nice and easy for us. I mean, this thing's going to end up being absolutely huge, but I suppose I could plate this, couldn't I? What do the plates look like? Yeah, so I've just realised it's going to have to... Because I don't want them being able to get up and bang on things here, so I want this to be low. Uh, we're going to have to go a bit higher for the actual blade drops themselves. Where's the issue start? Just here. Okay, so we're going to have to go one higher across here. We use uh, just under standard concrete blocks for this bit, I think. We're running a bit low and everything else. Okay, that was just pretty much all our concrete, uh, but that's okay. We need to build out this other side as well, don't we, to be the same as this one. So we come all the way along, okay. And before I forget, let's get some stairs in here. Okay, beautiful. So, you get the general idea of this place. I mean, you just want them to, you know, run directly for us. Uh, we also need to be working out how we want to place our dart traps, and we also need to get all these upgraded. So let's do that, because it's really important that this is all really strong material, because we don't want them to go for the sides. Oh, skill points, that's right. So, yeah, I was saving up eight skill points so I could do this. I wanted fortitude seven, uh, so I could then start just pumping points where I want to in fortitude. I don't think I need anything... I don't need level 10 in it at all, but so now I've got my strength level 10 and my fortitude level 7. Uh, I can cap out everything or get things as high as I want in all these areas, so that is perfect. Um, the, you know, the key ones being kind of pain tolerance, healing factor, living off the land. Uh, but I think for my next trick, I do want to get into heavy armor anyway, uh, and maybe the mining, so I probably will still be focusing on strength for a while. I just kind of wanted that done so I can put points as and when I need to, and not worry about, oh, well, I need to be level what, what, blah, blah, blah. I just, the way my brain works, it's just easier for me and more satisfying for me if I do it that way. Okay, it's taken about half our concrete to do that. We've got more crafting, but at a very slow rate. Now let's just get some wood frames. Like that, so we can just get up and down nice and easy for now. So that's all kind of plated. The rest of this, I think, can all be kind of flagstone or whatever. It's not really that important. Um, all the rest of the walls and whatever. Uh, we might just need to, however... How are we doing for cobble? We're not doing great in cobble. Let me just run back to base quickly. Let's just make what cobble we can. Uh, we've got a fair few darts there now, that's pretty nice. We need to start laying traps and all sorts. We really haven't got the time to be messing around with what I'm doing here. Uh, concrete. Please have a decent amount. Oh, 300 is not bad, actually. Put us back to, what? 440. <laughs> oh, wow. We really had to almost run out. Let's get at least this middle layer done. Yeah, at least there's a 300. Okay, that went a lot further than I thought. We just got this top layer. Yeah, that's fine. 
Okay, so that's pretty cool. That's all I really need, desperately need. We can have 200 of them. Cancel them and then queue them back up. And I think I'm going to have to come out one more on the side here. Oh, this ground's weird here. Okay. So I'm just placing plates here just to make this little hallway feel a bit deeper because we've got these uh, half blocks sitting right back there. Uh, it's just hard to see where you're placing these things. <laughs> okay, that kind of works. And then we want your standard blocks. wonder if I can pull this old trick off. Yes. I uh, just don't know how I'm... Oh, I suppose we could just do this. Uh, and then it's just these plates that are the problem. Let's get rid of them quickly. There we go, that's that side of the hallway, uh, the repairs hallway enclosed in. Um, so we want one, two, back. Where do we want this to go? Uh, let's just place these really quickly here. I think it was like there. Let's just see. Yeah, that'll work right there. That'll do for now. I haven't got time to be digging stuff out today. So now I just need to do that on that side. Um, right, okay, let's just try and do it. Oh, I haven't got time for you. Okay, that's it. Both sides enclosed in. We've got a way to repair the blade traps. We've got a way to repair the dart traps. We just haven't got any generators or engines over here just yet, but that's fine. Uh, we could probably just do with uh, putting a wall up around this thing and leaving a way out over here. Right, okay, the roof's going to have to be the last thing I worry about because I'm really running out of time here. Uh, I need to upgrade the stairs again. I uh, have to be worried about later. I, what I really need, more than anything right now, is a land claim block. And maybe some wood bars. Give me 70 of them. Alright, where's my mini bike? I think our hard base is just down here. Our current one. We're going to take on the hard in this new base. Alright, here we are. I need a land claim place in here. <laughs> That's not a land claim. <laughs> oh, okay. That's a land claim. Alright, give me that back. Shame you don't get the fuel back, but whatever. Give me that a generator. Oh, I did get the fuel back. Oh, amazing. Okay, and did we have anything else? Yes, these dart traps. Alright, give me those darts and give me those darts. I've actually got dart traps, so I don't, didn't need to get these, but, you know, nice to have them. Uh, so, yeah, this place is a one-and-done type of job, but, you know, it was fun for the first horde. Uh, and there's something weird... Oh, yeah, can't go that way. Uh, there's something weird about that horde night as well, and I was like, this feels odd. And I realised where it was afterwards. It's um, the fact that there wasn't just an incessant sound of electric fence posts. It was the first time I'd done a horde night in a long time. You've got to remember, from day seven of my Mad Scientist war uh, save, I had electric fence posts from day seven. So, yeah, it's been a long time since I've done a Horde Night without electric fence posts. Even in the Mall series of Eleanoria, where, you know, we use electric fence posts in the first Horde Night. Uh, here we are at the construction site. Uh, it's come together quite quickly, actually. Not too bad. Just hope some, I haven't missed something. Uh, we want this to be this layer of concrete because we want them to come for it. We've got a fence post in place, so... Uh, let's throw this down. Uh, oh yeah, that would be the thing, wouldn't it? I mean, I don't know if we've got enough uh, power for all the generators and whatever. But, you know, where can this go? That's uh, quite a nice tidy spot for it just there, isn't it? Okay. Uh, let's throw an engine in there, turn it on. I mean, I kind of want to see if that's working. Yeah, it's working. Okay, let's turn it off. We also need to wire these. Beautiful. Ah, uh, what a shame. That would be the spot. And the blade trap. Yeah, I can't, I can't reach that blade trap from here. Uh, no big deal, we'll just daisy chain it. We haven't put the dart traps in. I mean, we'll see if we have time, but if we go dart trapless for this horde, it's no big deal. Okay, what do we need? Why have I come here? What was I just doing? Why are we... Uh, engines, I need engines. One, two, three, four, five engines. I've only got nine steel. <laughs> That's not going to repair anything. Right. 
Okay, let's... One, two, three, four, five more. Turn on. Are they all going? They are beautiful. And we've even got power to play with there. Uh, the place to put things would be probably just here, actually. Can, will things go there? Oh, they will. Look at that. No, they won't. Block above them? Yeah. Yeah, we haven't got time. I haven't got time to place these uh, dart traps uh, where I would like them anyway. Uh, just purely because I'd have to remove these blocks and I just completely forgot about them. We'll go dart trapless this time. It's no big deal. I'd rather spend my time just kind of upgrading some of these stairs and stuff. Just make these a little bit tougher. And this layer all the way around, because this is the one they like to go for. There's nowhere else that really needs, needs cobble. I suppose I could just shore up these bottom ones here. Because these are like pillars that are quite important. There we go. So it's got a nice racing stripe down the side of it now. Not much else we can do, really. Uh, we just have to be really careful coming through here to check on... Uh, oh, that's one thing I need, more uh, concrete, but yeah. I mean, the one time I've built a way to repair the blade traps in the hallway is the time I've got no steel to do that with, but you know. Whatever. Uh, let's run over to this base over here. Ooh, let's get wait for this to get to 600. I shouldn't need any of these things right now. Keep the rebar on us just in case. Keep the wire tool on us just in case. Dart traps can go away with, along with the darts. Forge steel, kind of important I suppose. Getting loads of junk in here. Uh, switches we don't need for this time around. We don't need just one fence post. Uh, right, 612 it is. Let's just take 600 because that'll be an even amount of upgrades. Uh, we might as well grab our ammo and stuff then so... Grab all our shotgun shells. Grab these Molotovs, these pipe bombs, this pistol, this AK. I think that's really all we can do. We've got a rad remover, we've got a polymer string mod that I know I need to put on here. I keep forgetting about, there we go. Uh, this can have that in it. Uh, I suppose we could stick another two times on the pistol just to give it a bit more damage. Isn't much else really, is there? Not much else we can be doing to help ourselves other than bringing this, these items down. Nine mil, nine mil ammo. There we go. Yeah, we've got plenty of ammo for this horde, and I'm hoping to be mainly melee in anyway. They shouldn't get up there. I mean, apparently they can't path up those blocks. I'm not too worried about it. Okay, so we've got this side, which is upgraded, and this side, which isn't. Okay, so we need to run along the middle here. Okay, we've got 280 left, which is more than I expected. Uh, just to make it even... Copy that rotation, we just get these up here, just so they don't see any of it as overly weak. Leaves us with 60. So, might as well just do that. Probably should have actually saved some for in case we um, need to emergency repair this, but whatever. Uh, right, it's nearly time for the horde. Uh, I need to get rid of this way up, don't I? And just do a standard old pole. Okay, and let's craft a door, put that that way so they can't see a way in type thing. And I guess just to protect us against vultures, give us a fighting chance to spot them when they come in. Uh, right, so we probably don't need them down there, probably do need some of these healing items. Uh, let's make sure everything is loaded. We've got repair kits, we've got 15 repair kits, that's enough. One thing I haven't got is coffee. Let's make a run for it. Uh, uh, no, not a good time to do that. Go on, calmly go up. Don't panic. There we go. Grab your bacon and eggs. Grab your coffee. And I'll tell you what, just in case it all goes pear shaped, grab uh, those mega crush as well. <laughs> right, let's get over. I'm going to throw a chest egg. We're inevitably going to need one. Let's throw some of the stuff we don't immediately need in there. Lighten our load a bit. Awesome. Uh, all right, generator on. It's refueled. Alright. Yeah, we can swing that there, that's good. Okay, eat your bacon and eggs. Drink your coffee. Pop a couple of them. Should have taken skull crushers. There's always something, isn't there? Alright, let's see how this paths. I, for one, am nervous. Alright, there's a dog. Just... That's the only bad thing. Dogs, uh, won't get caught in that. Now, is this... There we go. Perfect. Oh, yes! Taking their heads clean off with this. 
Oh, I think I'm in love with this already. Oh, yes. Get out of it. Oh, you can really get a good sweep in motion. Let me just turn this game sound down for you. There you go, that game sound's been turned down because I just realised that would be really obnoxious. Oh, and I like it when you can get a really good... There you go, like that, when you can knock multiples down at once. <laughs> Alright, that dog. There's a dog here somewhere that I can't hit. Whoa. Right, I can hear a vulture. Oh, do you know what we've forgotten? Do you know what we've forgotten? I say we. Do you know what I've forgotten? Things to repair the fence post with. So, yeah, this uh, we probably will be running for our lives out of this place. Because those fence posts are not going to last all night. But look at the XP flying in. Alright, let's take a uh, first aid kit here. Alright, go. Oh, beautiful. I suppose, once the fence posts go, that's when we start just firing like crazy with the AK. This spider won't die. Go away. Yeah, because the, the beauty of all this is you can just kind of fire down the corridor and get them, can't you? I think the uh, hammer's actually more effective at clearing them. Get out of it. Okay, I think that was wave one. Beautiful. I love just timing that swing. <laughs> and like that. Just the way it takes multiples of them down is so satisfying. Skull Crusher is a great perk. I got I don't know how I got two head pops simultaneously in those two then. <laughs> they were stood about five feet apart. Nice, okay. You can see what this does now, so what I'll do is I'll take a bandage to stop that bleed right there. Uh, I need to start wearing the heavy armour. And what I'll do is I will fast forward and I'll cut back in if things get a bit scary once the uh, fence posts break, which is what I imagine will happen. I'm starting to get debuffs now as well. That's no, not ideal, but you know, we'll keep fighting on. I'll cut back in. Okay, so the fence post went. Uh, is that, that can't be all of them, can it? Where are we? We're game stage 55, level 33. Uh, okay, well, I suppose that is all of them. Um, but yeah, the I can hear somebody out there. Let's drop down. Just you? Refusing to path? Yeah, better be careful, because like she's just running up to that random building there and smashing it up. That's not even a random building. That's going to be part of my base eventually. Let's jump up here. Oh, health goes down when you jump with a sprained leg. Okay, so yeah, let's just get some loot. 
Uh, let's actually throw away everything we've got on us in here. And let's pop an eye candy. Okay, so we didn't need all that ammo at all. Uh, the sledge just seems to replenish your uh, stamina when you get a kill with it, so it's pretty awesome. And uh, yeah, this base works out well. I just need to have the materials to repair my fence posts. Uh, but even with, after, you know, the fence posts went, I was doing a decent job of holding them back. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, it's a nice, uh, nice little base. It works well. Uh, the blade traps will come into their own once the hordes get kind of more intense and bigger. And can we reach that one? Yes, we can. All right, what did we get? Anything good? Yeah, same old junk that we usually get. Uh, treasure map's pretty nice. Let's read that. Oh, of course, they put it in the snow pile for me, don't they? Uh, right, okay, let's just run around here. Shouldn't be running, really, with this sprained leg, should I? And just get his last loot drop. Bit of cash, bit of cash. Right, I suppose let's just get all the jumping out of the way, because I need to jump up and down my base here a couple of times. They have taken out some frames here, interestingly. There we go. Easy repair. Let's just throw away all this ammo we just got. Trader chest is pretty bare right now, so let's just throw some of the items in there we want to sell. And in here, motor tool parts can live. Okay, let's sprint back over, put this timer up even more. Let's grab all our uh, normal wares out of our boxer. Awesome. But yeah, that worked pretty well. Pretty happy with that. Okay, let's uh, get all this put away. We'll have to use the guns more later on, I imagine. But as it stands, you know, we're not really needing to use our guns all that much. I'm just messing around with the shape here. So I can see how that was like that and maybe goes all the way down. I'm not sure. Uh, so maybe we'll keep that element of the uh, build there. That's pretty cool. I don't think I want this to... Hmm. How do I want to do this? I quite like the idea of this being like a little balcony or something. Okay, so just been messing around with some blocks. Uh, didn't fancy mining this morning. Uh, got a few more there now made up. Uh, just to see what this kind of looked like, because there were some angled pieces in the roof already. And I was just wondering what it kind of looked like if we followed through with the uh with how the angle but it looks okay and then it can kind of go up again up there and this could be a little balcony area i guess yeah yeah no we can probably get something pretty cool out of this the only problem is of course we've already started uh working on all this so a lot of these blocks will have to come out that we've already put in that's no big deal they're fairly easy to knock out yeah i can hear zombies i was just uh, trying to knock out a couple of blocks before i finished where are you? You in here? Oh yeah, of course you are. Get out of it. Right, okay, so I suppose it's a good time uh, to say goodbye anyway. Uh, yeah, we took on the horde. We pretty much used the sledgehammer all night. I think I had to knock out the, uh, the AK a couple of times there. Just mainly for the spiders and dogs, but honestly, I was finding I was clearing everything a lot quicker with the hammer than I was anything else. What I need to do is simply take out this bottom layer all the way along here and collapse this whole wall and then we'll have the room starting here and then we'll have this as a little balcony and we'll tear this thing up as we go along it should look pretty cool um, so yeah suppose I'll do that so I have some work cut out for me here so what I'll do is I'll end this one here say so thank you so much for watching really is appreciated I mean if you've made it this far into the video why not give it a like it'll uh, cheer, cheer me up and brighten my day a little bit uh, and also hit subscribe if you're watching the videos and you haven't, haven't hit subscribe because you think, what's the point? It pops up in my recommended anyway because I'm always watching you. You know, just uh, think of it as a way of saying thanks to me. Um, you know, it'll, it really just cheers me up to see my subscription numbers going up. So, you know, if you're watching me all the time and you haven't hit subscribe, uh, just please do it. It really helped me out. Come and say hello in the comments as well. I'd love to say hello back to you. And uh, for you, you people who are staying right till the end of this video, a uh, little treat for you. What I'll do is I'll keep recording and I will collect this wall and I'll have that collapse on film right at the end of this episode uh, so tell me what you think about that in the comments again it'll just be for us who stay right to the end our little secret club that the people who just skip around all the videos don't know about uh, thank you so much have a great day and have a good one and I'll see you later bye bye right here we go there you go that was for all of you thank you very much bye bye